Hi, I'm Aizat. I am from Brutani. I handle marketing. For Brutani, we have four of us. We are all high school friends. Four of us are close friends. So it's not that easy because you have to take care of their feelings and at the same time, you have to be professional. This is our pineapple plantation, our small pineapple plantation. We have about 10,000 pineapple trees here. So we do have uh, two plots of lands that we planted uh, MD2 pineapple. So here is around 10,000 trees. Uh, and another plot of land is around three to 5,000 uh, pineapple trees. Every pineapple tree here are all measured to the exact number in between the trees so that when they grow at the adult stage, they, they wouldn't have different sizes of uh, pineapple fruit. They would take exactly around 140 days to bear the full pineapple fruit that can be harvested. MD2 pineapple stands for Mili Dillard. So that is a person name. He is the founder for the breed, for MD2 breed. What's so special about the, uh, the breed MD2 pineapple is that first, the sweetness itself. It is one of the sweetest pineapple breed in the world. And then second also, is the costing. It is not that expensive to take care of and then it's easy. It's also it's a family of cactus, so it's easy to take care of. You don't have to you don't have to water it every day. Main reason we chose pineapple is because of the market potential. As a company, our values is to to provide healthy options, healthy options to the consumers, customers at an affordable price. Currently focusing on our juice, which is Pina Lima. It is basically just pineapple cold press with a bit of lime. In terms of pricing, how we actually, to be honest with you, we are not, our margin is not that big because we want to offer affordability to the consumers. As you guys know, like now we are facing with climate issues, right? So there's floods everywhere. Uh, we were affected a bit, but we decided to. What we were affected was that the most of our farm were like flooded with water, so it's not good for pineapple because pineapple is a dry kind of tree, so it's super sensitive to water. So we decided to do like drainage system, which is super big, bigger than most, so to prevent future floods. This is our first time like doing business during Ramadan period because last year during Ramadan we were focusing on plantation. Honestly, we are not sure but we are hoping for the best. We are hoping that we our sales increase through promotions. And then also during Ramadan as you guys know we will get super thirsty especially during the evening right before buka puasa right. So instead of drinking non-healthy drinks, we are providing a better option for the consumers which is it is made from natural sugar and then it is better for people to break their fast. Starting a business, I know this is cliche but it's not easy and then especially when you do with your friends it's not easy, it's not just like sunshine and rainbows. One thing I would recommend to the to people who wants to start their own business is you have to have a tough mental strength. You have to surround yourself with good people to motivate you, not to like uh, discourage you.